this his last kick of a football for Chelsea? He can't believe it. Match day one brought Bundesliga runners-up Leverkusen to Stamford Bridge. Their young striker, Sidney Sam, questioned Chelsea's credentials in the build-up to the game. Off full time, he'd been subbed and his side comfortably beaten. Leverkusen were grateful to teenage keeper Bernd Leno for a string of fine saves in the first half, but the second half brought the home fans what they desired. Without the need for fists, David Luiz enjoyed his first goal in the competition. And Juan Mata continued a fabulous first month in Chelsea Blue. 2-0 and a perfect start, particularly against a side who'd been fancied to muddy the waters of Group E. But there was nothing cagey about the match at the Mustaya. Both keepers had busy evenings, but he would be beaten eventually. Frank Lampard's status had become something of a hot topic by mid-September, but Salomon Kalou's late introduction, which was intended to help the all-round defensive effort, turned sour. With just three minutes on the clock, Soldado levelled from the spot. An infuriating end to a lively game, but this would be just the start of a long list of lost leads away from home in Europe over the next few months. Morelles, tons of space, worth a crack, and has it. Oh, it scores! What a beauty! And Chelsea have their early goal. Here's Torres, he's in. Great first touch. Oh, and a wonderful finish! Back in the side and back on the score sheet. And Chelsea are two up. Morelles, a wonderful ball in for Torres. He's got another one. And Chelsea have three. Two in a game for FT. This is a Blues cruise. Maluna's ball in to Ivanovic. It's four. He loves the Champions League goal. Cross this time is brilliant. Well, so is the save. There's the follow up. And Kalou has scored. Well teed up. Jose Basinga in the cross. The task looked easier still, once Ramirez had very tidily opened the scoring on 25 minutes. Hugo Samba points. Second goal before the break by the penalty spot, but he won't take it. Nelka had missed one the previous week at Everton. Torres didn't seem to fancy it, and with neither Drogba nor Lampard on the field, David Luiz assumed responsibility. Then immediately reached the Genk went for it in the second half and were well worth their equaliser. It was teed up by Kevin De Bruyne and finished by Yeli Vossen. Having lost three of the previous four matches, Javier Boas and his side needed a result. It was Batman night at the Bay Arena. Petr Cech's effort matched by Michael Ballack. Chelsea's big occasion superhero Didier Drogba once again pushed himself ahead of Fernando Torres in the pecking order and he justified his selection with a well-taken opening goal on 48 minutes. Aaron Dirty Ock equalised. In added time came the killer blow. Manuel Friedrich found a gap, jumped into it, and bang. The defeat had once again been snatched from the jaws of victory. Eventually swings over a left into cross. Brilliant touch from Mata. Here's Didier Drogba, shifting one way, then the other, and finding the bottom corner. Perfect start for Chelsea. It's Didier Drogba again. Ball for Jordi Alba, great touch as well, and Alba smacks it against the post. It's at the shots, and Czech forced to turn it behind. That was travelling from Belder as well. Ramirez is his option. That's too heavy. But Ramirez has bullied his way through and scored. What an awful mix-up between Victor Ruiz and Diego Alves. Here's Drogba, this should be three, it is three, Chelsea are going through. With 14 minutes remaining, Didier Drogba ices the cake. Yeah, Borre forward as Sturridge plays it in, a big bobble, mistake by Cannavaro, goal by Juan Mata. Chelsea lead in Napoli. There's the away goal. This is what they let it go. Lovesi shoots, that's brilliant. And the best player on the pitch has brought Napoli level. Great ball in from Inler. It's behind everyone and Cavani's poked it in. Right on half time. Cavani, the man in form. Ball forward. Luis should deal with it, but he hasn't. Cavani has Lovesi with him. Big problems here for Chelsea. 3 1 Napoli. And it's looking like a huge task now. Lovetsy has another. Amshik, 
Amshik, oh that took a deflection. Lionel Levesi from the angle, it was always against him too. And Mires delivery, Drogba! Lift off for Chelsea! Didier Drogba with a bullet header. What a delivery from Ramirez. That's delivery. Terry, 2-0. The captain does it just after half-time. And as it stands, Chelsea are going through. Terry, drop for in. Oh, what a goal that is. Here comes the corner now then. What did that strike? It hit the Sainer's hand. The referee. Lampard scores. 3-1 to Chelsea. The Sainer. Ivanovic! Four for Chelsea! Is that the goal that sends the Blues through to the last day? Branislav Ivanovic thumps it in. Drop it down the line. Referee blows the whistle. Chelsea have done it. But every run has to end sometime, and Chelsea's high flyers produced the perfect professional. The middle of Jardel. Torres needs some help in the middle. He's found Kalou! There's the away goal. Brilliant from Ramirez. Brilliant from Torres. By Kalou, ball over the top for Ashley Cole to chase, and he goes down. Pushed over by Garcia. Penalty Chelsea. And the referee reaching for a card as well. 50 for Chelsea. Scores just about as he did against Napoli. Lampard converts from 12 yards in front of the Matthew Harding stand. And Chelsea lead 1-0 on it's the night for Pereira, who slides in. And now then, Maxi Pereira's already been booked. John Obi McKell is down, and Maxi Pereira is off. Oh, it's headed in by Javi Garcia. Goodness me, we're in for a nervy last five minutes to get into safety. No foul there, Morelos flicked it over Imar's head. Here comes Ramirez with one of those powerful runs. It's still Morelos! What a goal! Chelsea are through to the semi-finals of the Champions League. Pichu, as Barca will always look to throw him right back. Alexis Sanchez is onside here, against the crossbar. Played back to Iniesta to drive in, check, and this one's Fabregas. Lionel Messi, he slipped it through, it sets Fabregas! Actually go to the rescue! It's on its way, dribbling into the corner of the net. Here comes Ramirez, surging forward, and a really good first touch. Droppers at the far post, he treats Droppa, and Chelsea lead! Chelsea stand the bearer, slides them in front. What a beautifully engineered break, and a mistake by Lionel Messi. It's Adriano. Winning Alexis Sanchez, now says Fabregas, lifted into Alexis Sanchez. And he has fluffed his lines. Missing the chances they're creating, brilliantly created. Messi clipped in, Puyol with a header! Big save that by Pedacek. Slip through to Busquets, back heel towards Messi. Fantastic challenge by Terry, hit by Pedro, hits the post! Oh, and over by Busquets! Drama to the last!
Messi has to turn his back and he slips it through beautifully. Chelsea's hopes are crumbling here before the interval. Well, this is going to be painful for Chelsea. Hard done well on this rare attack it. and it's a lovely ball as well. A chance here. It's a goal. Oh. Ramirez arrives from nowhere to give Chelsea hope Such again. That's involved everywhere. Chelsea have made the worst possible start in the second half. Who has scored 63 times this season. And Messi has missed it. He still hasn't found the net against Chelsea. Incredible. Well, I'm going to say it again. Written in the stars. Bramble here. Pugo trying to come out with the ball, but the referee has already blown the whistle for a free kick to Chelsea. And it's uh, into one of the many gaps now. Looking for Sanchez. Oh, that's brilliant stuff. Hopeful punt goalwards to Yester. And on to young Quinker. Good save check. He does have a very good scoring record against Barcelona. It's Messi. Offside, offside. Won't count, it's offside. The flag went up before Sanchez hit the ball. Pulls the trigger, hits the post. The shot for handball. Is it? Is it? Fernando Torres. This could be. The most dramatic story of the season. It's Torres oh! to give Chelsea a place in the Champions League final. The headline has been written. £50 million pounds has just been repaid by Fernando Torres, scorer of the goal that will send Chelsea Football Club to Munich. They've done it. It's tonight. Chelsea will never forget one of the greatest moments in their history. They have triumphed here against the odds and against the team that's been called the best European football has ever seen. Just in there, five players who figured in the Moscow final four years ago. Marine. 